Now, just last week, we saw severe weather throughout central North Carolina with high winds and tornadoes. Now, we were under an enhanced risk when those storms hit us. There are five levels of alerts when it comes to severe weather, but do they, what do they actually mean? CBS 17 Storm Team meteorologist Melissa Lefevre breaks down each one and explains why you need to pay attention. Parts of the southeast are under yet another high risk for severe storms, and that's a five out of five. But who issues these risk categories? Severe thunderstorm outlets are issued by the Storm Prediction Center, which is in Norman, Oklahoma. Now, the outlooks highlight areas that have a chance of severe storms and how high that threat level is. Categories are based on the probability that a severe weather event will occur within 25 miles of a given spot. A severe storm is defined as a thunderstorm producing one of the following. Measured wind gusts of at least 58 miles per hour, hail at least one inch in diameter, and or a tornado. Now the categories go one to five, and a category one is a marginal risk. This means isolated severe storms may develop, but not every storm will be severe. A slight risk means scattered severe storms are possible with isolated tornadoes, hail, and wind all possible hazards. The enhanced risk is issued when numerous severe thunderstorms are possible and you expect more activity with stronger storms in your area. A category four or a moderate risk translates to widespread severe storms being likely with longer lived storms, and the majority of storms will meet that severe criteria. And finally, the rare high risk is issued. Issued when widespread intense severe storms are expected, tornadoes could be strong to violent and on the ground for a long time. Damaging wind and large hail could also bring significant damage. Now, no matter the risk that's issued for central North Carolina, it's a good idea to have your severe weather plan ready to go because it only takes one. For CBS 17 News, I'm meteorologist Melissa Lefevre.